Where's the bulldozer? Ooh, look here. Let's get in a safe area before we do that shit. Ooh, it's a train. It's a train. Okay, let's read a book. I wonder why. Sarah trusted her gut, and her gut said Agent Nightingale was an asshole. Mm -hmm, I agree. He felt wrong, and it wasn't just the smell of stale booze. It was in the way he flashed his badge. Freaking alcoholic. Blank, the look in his eyes when he wanted answers. Where was Alan Wake? What was this about an accident? Where was his wife? And most importantly, why did she let Wake go? He wouldn't answer her questions. Federal business was all he'd say. Crazy stuff. Okay, batteries, got shotgun ammo, revolver, good. Gets. Well, <laughs> we'll probably need all the. Oh, we'll need all the ammo we can to fight a bulldozer. Hello? The most stubborn man I've ever met. Alice? <gasps> Alice? Alan. Alan. I'm so afraid. It keeps me in the dark. Please help me. I look at you, Alan, and it's not you. Something else. Looking out from behind your eyes. Alice, I'm here. I don't think that's Alice, dude. I'm so alone here. It's all gonna go to hell. You need to be careful. Cooperate. It's all a lie. The connection had been terrible, but that wasn't the only thing that hadn't been right with the call. She sounded wrong yeah. somehow, but she had called me. Well, something called you. That's for sure. Ooh. Man, we're getting a lot of papers. I like this. <laughs> she wrenched itself loose from the bridge's steel framework. Wrapped in darkness, it floated in midair, twitching. For a moment, I didn't understand what I was looking at. The heavy object lurched at me with impossible force. I threw myself out of the way, but just barely. When I turned my flashlight on it, it shook in a dark rage before it flew at me again. Hmm. A lot of creepy stuff happening here. I could see a railway bridge up ahead and a warehouse of some sort on the opposite shore. I hoped I could find a car from there. Uh, not quite yet. Let's check out back here. Uh, secret? Yeah. Nice. Battery. Oh, heck yeah. Okay, let's see here. Hello. Is it going to. Oh! Uh oh! There's gonna be darkness coming at me. Yeah, the darkness that was pursuing me was growing stronger, and it was taking over everything in its path. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Oh, no. Whew. I think we did it. I have to worry about everything now. Freaking hitchhikers, freaking police officers, freaking barrels and inanimate objects and pipes. Everything's out to kill me. 
Okay, let's read this. I slammed the door shut right in his smug face. He pleaded for me to open the door. True to form, the asshole actually thought I would obey. I had no sympathy left, no guilt either, not for him. I took a moment to savor the scream. I bet I had a smile on my face. It was all that I had time for. The dark presence was inside the lodge with me. Creepy. As a teenager, just starting to get interested in writing, Stephen King had been a source of inspiration to me. I thought about all the inanimate objects that had come to life in his books. No one is safe in a good horror story. Yeah. Certainly not the protagonist. That's what makes them fun. This was anything but. <laughs> the darkness could possess anything. And it was getting closer. <gasps> oh. Hold up. Need to switch to heavy duty flashlight. <laughs> so I get updated flashlights. Upgraded flashlights. I wasn't expecting that to happen. I don't want to go down here. I want you. Hmm? I heard that. Okay, let's continue. Um, dude. No, I did not. What did grow on? Now let me through. Okay, what do we have back here? In light, you can hurt them. Really? Hello? Checkpoint. Yes, thank you. Thank you, please, yes. Mm. There's a vehicle. Let's see if we can get to it without dying. There's not a bulldozer here, is there? Oh. Wake attacked by the dark. The person. darkness surged towards me, sucking everything loose from the ground into its depths, tugging at my clothes. I saw the flare the kidnapper had dropped and threw myself towards it just as I felt my feet leave the ground. The darkness embraced me with the force of a tornado. Somehow I managed to light the flare. The darkness roared and cast me away. I fell toward the dark waters of the lake far below. Interesting. Whoa. Okay. Something's about to go down. Oh. Oh, there is a bulldozer. Fanta- oh jeez, oh jeez. Are you kidding me? Eh. Huh. I'm lighting the flare. Screw this. Huh. Huh. Crap, how can I- Yeah. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh jeez! <laughs> no, 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 no! Got it! <sighs> oh jeez! That was... That was different. Okay. Let's continue. Out of my way. Give me some coffee. Do, do we get to drive again? That would be awesome. Let's ride. Uh-oh. Never been this glad to see the sunrise. Me neither. I had a couple of hours to get to the coal mine. Jeez.
The coal mine wasn't far now. 